diamonds, timeless symbols of love, luxury, and beauty. Colorless diamonds are the most common, but these mesmerizing geologic marvels can occasionally show off some radiant flair. One such diamond, tipping the scale at 2.33 carats, is among the largest of its kind. Behold, the Winston Red Diamond. More than three billion years ago, diamonds formed under high pressure and extreme heat deep below the Earth's crust. Volcanic eruptions rapidly propelled them to the surface. If the diamonds had traveled even a little bit slower, they would have cooled into graphite. Instead, they became glimmering pieces of carbon in the form of diamond crystals. When we think of diamonds, we typically picture clear, colorless stones, the ultimate symbol of luxury. But that image, it was carefully crafted by brilliant marketing. Slogans like, a diamond is forever, aren't just catchy, they're true. Diamonds are eternal, making them a classic and expensive romantic gesture. The clearer the diamond, the higher the price. But there are unique exceptions. Fancy color diamonds. Yes, that's the real scientific term. Fancy color diamonds are remarkably rare. The chances that a diamond will exhibit an intense color is one in 10,000. These distinctive hues, caused by impurities or structural defects, are what set them apart. In this case, imperfections actually make them more perfect. Just like a rainbow, fancy color diamonds have a way of captivating us with their sheer impossibility and beauty. Let's take a closer look. Blue diamonds are among the rarest of all the fancy color diamonds, with only about one in 200,000 diamonds displaying even a hint of blue. Their stunning blue hue is caused by the presence of the element boron, with the intensity of the color depending on how much boron is present. The 45.52 carat Hope Diamond is among the most famous diamonds in the world and resides at the Smithsonian's National Museum of Natural History. In the case of green diamonds, the color comes from something truly unusual, radiation damage. When naturally occurring radiation interacts with the diamond's crystal structure, it creates holes that turn the surface of the diamond a greenish hue. Interestingly, the color is usually only on the surface, giving the diamond a greenish outer coat. Yellow diamonds, also called canary diamonds, get their radiant color from nitrogen. These diamonds can be found all over the world, although most come from South Africa. The largest natural yellow diamond ever discovered weighed a staggering 616 carats. Try turning that into an engagement ring. Orange and brown diamonds, along with many shades in between, owe their warm, earthy tones to a nitrogen impurity. While brown diamonds are more common, orange diamonds are considered incredibly rare. But among the rarest? The fancy red diamond. Diamonds like the Winston Red, pure, fancy red and large in size, are so hard to find that less than 30 stones currently exist in public record that weigh more than one carat. The Winston Red, named after Ronald Winston, who donated it to the Smithsonian, is ready for its close-up. It's taking center stage in a new exhibition at the Natural History Museum, surrounded by fancy color diamonds that span the rainbow. Fancy a look at these dazzling gems and cherish the geological near impossibility they represent. Be sure to check out more exciting Smithsonian stories on another episode of National Treasure.